It's a proprietary name um, to a certain extent, but by the same token, usually proprietary names are owned by by a particular producer. In this case, it's not owned by. Them. It's just an indication that it isn't. It is non-vintage, but it's not the non-vintage brand, which indicates the relative dryness of that champagne. Well, what else do you have here? We've got two single vineyard, single properties, Sancerre from Pascal Jolivet. We have an old vine, unfined, unfiltered Pinot Noir, Sancerre from Pascal Jolivet. We have Gigandas from, from Paul Jaboulet. We have Petite Chapelle, La Chapelle from Hermitage from Paul Jaboulet. And we have a very cool 
Old Vine, Malbec. I'm going to move this over a little bit. Uh, Chateau La Grisette in Cahors, the ancestral uh, home of Malbec from uh, southern France. So the first wine that you'll taste is, is Le Caillot. It is, uh, again, a Sancerre. It's a small vineyard, less than 10 acres. That is old vines, over 40-year-old vines. And also, um, it, is, it is mostly uh, limestone. The limestone, clay, and chalk are the three soil series of Sancerre. And usually they're a blend of all three, but in this case it's all limestone, so it's a very pronounced mineral. And that is opposed to Dunose, which is Chateau Dunose, another small uh, specific property that has all three soil series and has a warmer profile and is actually known for its tropical flavors because of the, the warmth. The limestone gives you minerality, the clay and the, and the chalk give you more uh, more heat absorption, so as a result, riper style is something like that. That takes care of the whites, and we're going to come back and do the reds. Okay. Right? So, I'm Keith. I'm Brian. So am I. <laughs> <laughs> I like that part. <laughs> and this is DifferentWineGuys.com. Be right back. Salute.